Hey, how you doing? Today is the day of the Kansas City premiere of The Outhouse, the movie. And uh, I'm happy to say that for Brad, at least he was able to get some publicity for it. So that looks positive. Whether he makes his money back tonight or not, I'm still hopeful. But, uh, yeah, I was uh, in YJ's yesterday. And um, one of the baristas, Sean, was was talking about it. And I overheard it, so I had to jump up immediately and, and chime in on the whole conversation. And Are you guys going? Because they really need a lot of people to show up. And they're like, well, we don't know. It's $15. You just got to show up and pay at the window at the uptown and you'll go right in. Okay. And, uh, and I showed them the video because they didn't know anything about it. They're a younger generation. They were like, I, it was some sort of metal club or something. I said, no, no, no. And I showed them this, this video of the trailer and they were like, oh, wow. You mean they played there? You mean he interviewed that guy? He interviewed them? Oh, wow. And they were asking me, how long were you there? Did you go to the outhouse? And I'm like, yeah, way back when. And how were you know, they just they were just immensely curious. And, uh, you know, it's just, it's just interesting how history has faded, you know, people's memory because they didn't have anything to do with it or whatever. And now it's like... Um, you can share with a new generation who are curious about these things and Brad has done a great thing by by making this movie and, and making it a really good movie and I'm happy to have been a part of it in a very tiny insignificant way but at least in some way and uh, you know you can feel good about things in life and 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 some of these things that matter the most are these little things you know it's funny how the things that matter the most often pay the least but and um, again Brad has really shown some strength and stamina in doing this and um, more strength than I ever had and following through with it keeping his head up and and just doing it despite the difficulties and the naysayers who are always there and will always be there and uh, you know he's put himself through a lot of debt and I hope I hope for him it pays off financially but I, I think that it's already starting to pay off in many other ways for him it's just a financial part I would like to see because, I mean, if anybody deserves it, he really does. I'm taking the doggies for a walk. And uh, we're going to see how far we can get today. Uh, we're going to walk here in the crossroads, power and light maybe. It's cold, cold as hell. We'll see how far we can get.